Okay, George Groves versus Glenn Johnson. Um, this is probably the best opponent. That, well, it is the best opponent that um, George Groves has fought. Um, for me, George Groves has been far too inactive. He's had a lot of injuries. Um, but anyway, he's got the fight against Glenn Johnson Saturday night. A lot of people are looking forward to it. A lot of people said, well, the last three or four fights Glenn Johnson's been in, he hasn't looked the same fighting. He's looked 43 years old. Yes, I have to agree. Um, and I said that I thought that uh, George Groves wins the fight by an unanimous points decision. Now I have a different opinion. And he goes like this. Um, they said the last thing a fighter loses is punch. And I believe that Glenn Johnson takes a heck of a punch. I'm not so sure about George Groves' chin. Um, I believe that Johnson fights well under pressure. I'm not so sure about George Groves. I believe that Johnson's got excellent stamina. I still am not sure about George Groves. There are a lot of question marks about George Groves that um, the Kenny and it's, I think it's mainly because of the Kenny Anderson fight. And I I would like to see him fight Kenny Anderson and close that once and for all to say you know what I um, I beat Kenny Anderson and that's it. Um, Adam Booth again I said before and Adam if you're watching the video how are you doing mate hope you well. Um, Adam Booth's a shrewd shrewd man and. Um, I think he's probably been talking to George, and I can imagine Adam Booth saying to George, Right, mate, this is it. You've got to show me what you can do. Can you box to a game plan against a top athlete or a top contender or a fringe world contender? Can you do it? Can you show me it's time to push you on? You know, because um, they pulled out the Kenny Anderson fight for whatever reason. Uh, maybe it was general injury or maybe they didn't fancy the fight and thought that Kenny Anderson stood a good chance after Kenny Anderson almost beat George Groves and let's be fair Kenny Anderson only had a few weeks to prepare for the fight can you imagine a fully fit Kenny Anderson with proper preparation for the fight how he would have done so you know there's that question mark there and of course even the Paul Smith fight before um, George smashed or knocked uh, uh, Smith out, Paul Smith out, in the first round he got clocked for a very good punch at the end of the round, um, and again the Sierra fight he was stunned in that fight as well, um, so I think the fight's going to go like this, if Glenn Johnson has any ambition whatsoever for this fight, I think within the first four rounds of this fight, first four rounds, if Glenn Johnson's got any real ambition in this fight, or the first, yeah, first, no, first six rounds. I'll give Glenn that. First six rounds. If Johnson's got any ambitions, it's going to be within the first six rounds, I believe. It's going to be Glenn Johnson's territory. That's where I think it's going to be highly dangerous. Um, and I think, my belief is this. George Groves has got to discourage um, Glenn Johnson early. He must not allow Glenn Johnson to get any sort of confidence. And what I mean by that is he must not allow... Johnson to be able to hurt him. If Johnson is able to buckle the legs of, 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 of George Groves, he will pour it on. He will come non-stop at him. He will encourage him. And he will, he will really take his chances. At 43 years old, I mean, what does he need to do? Who, who, who's going to want to fight Glenn Johnson now? At 43 years old for a world title again. He's fought all the best guys. So, you know, but he may want another paycheck. You know, so he's going to retire. He didn't think he could do well anymore. He thought it was time for him to pack it in, and probably it is time for him to pack it in. And uh, we don't know, I haven't seen much footage of Johnson training for this fight. But, you know, he's, he, you know, I've never seen Johnson come to the ring out of shape. So, uh, um, yeah, the first six rounds of this fight, if he's got any ambition, like I said, Johnson, it will show in the first six rounds. If Johnson's to win this fight by knockout, it's in the first six, I believe. Um, after that, I believe that George Groves will control the fight. So for me, George Groves has got to hit Johnson early. And it really depends on how much Johnson's got left. Um, otherwise, late stoppage for... I'm going to go... Otherwise, late stoppage for George Groves or, you know, I'm supporting position, like I said before. But, um, yeah.
Early rounds for for John for early for Johnson, late for Groves. Okay, that's my prediction. I'm out. <laughs>